everyone welcome back to my channel it's Mia and today I am doing a review on the new Pink Honey collection which is the Wonder Wax collection um as you all know I'm a big fan of Pink Honey products in general so I thought I'd have to try this one out on camera I've done a few well plenty of tutorials using it I've done a few videos featuring just it just a gel so i thought it was only right for me to do a product review on this as well so hopefully you enjoy this video and if you do please remember to like subscribe and hit the bell to make sure there's none of my future videos so if you want to hear my opinion and see how this works then keep on watching <laughs> Excuse the lighting today because the one day that I sit down to film, it's bright and sunny in my room. I don't know if you can see this. I've had to put the blinds down. Um, it's the only way to do it, but we move. So, um, this is the Wonder Wax. So, I've got all the products here that come with the whole package. So, this is the card here. There we go. Wonder Wax, Pink Honey. And I got the shade Chocolate. Um, there is the original, which I can't remember the name of. Then there's Fudge and then there's Chocolate. So, this says, I'll read the instruction card out. Wonder Wax, new formula, no water needed. So, just a little heads up for those of you who don't know. This is basically like soap brown. But obviously, with soap brown, you have to spray the spool it or you have to wet it like that's usually the case whereas with this it's not which is what makes it so revolutionary so as I, as I was saying Pink Honey Wonder Wax our latest innovative creation unlike anything else on the market yet we've designed a brow wax that no longer requires water or a liquid activator as all our Pink Honey products do it has a delicious scent this is our stickiest strongest and most effective formula yet we've designed this formula to bring you the ultimate brow hole product the formula is designed to coat and hold every brow hair for extreme holding texture. If the hairs are thick or sparse, this formula will lift and create full looking brows. This hold is unrivaled and by far our best yet. This can be used by all hair types and is enriched with vitamins and moisturising compounds. So, in the actual package what you get is that you get obviously the Wonder Wax, which looks like this. The packaging is so cute, very sturdy. And then on the wax, it's uh, on the bottom. It says Wonder Wax, cruelty free, vegan, long lasting, made in the UK, thirty mils, um, not to be consumed for external use only. Keep out of reach of children. Only to be used on the eyebrow area in the event of contact with the eyeball. Rinse thoroughly with water. And then we open it, and I love how it has this like cover on it. And you pop that off, and there you have the product. And can I just say? that is probably like probably my favorite scent she's ever done probably i've got to be honest like it actually smells like chocolate fudge cake in fact it's making me a bit hungry so i'm gonna have to close it but um it looks exactly the same as the gel as in texture wise it looks like it but it's not let me show let me assure you and then you also get the bamboo stick the honey dippers and then the like these new things which are plastic and you get quite a couple of these as well one two three four five six seven eight i think you get about ten of them um and honestly these are the best spoolies ever the lighting's really annoying me now i do apologize for the lighting again it's really irritating me but i had to film it today because i thought i can't miss another week so the spoolies are also the best spoolies ever for anything like hands down but I am going to be inserting a clip now showing you how I used it and how I got these brows that I've gotten today. So these are probably some of my favourite brows ever, I'm not going to lie.
So when I first applied it, I'm not going to lie, I did think, oh my god, this is a bit intense. It wasn't what I was expecting. Um, I think I was expecting a formula like the Cola Cubes, which is my actual favourite um, pink honey gel. Because that, that is tinted, however it doesn't have as much of the tint as this, literally, I'm not even joking you. Um, with the Pink Honey Cola Cubes gel, I do usually have to go in and fill the brows in. I have not used another product on my brows today. Not one other product. Not any eyeshadow or um, brow powder. It's just this. Like, it tints the brow and the skin, un like, it's just unreal. And it looks a lot more natural, as in, when you add powder, you know, it can get a bit gunky sometimes. This is so smooth. And it is darker than I expected, but I actually really like it. Obviously, I do have dark hair. So, if you are unsure of what shade to go for, go and visit their website and go and visit their Instagram. However, um, I wouldn't recommend it to anyone that's even a shade lighter than me. I'd recommend the fudge or get the original no no shade like clear one because um like i say this is probably only for my color hair or darker but it's beautiful and honestly it just has the most gorgeous finish it's super super easy um and it's definitely definitely the strongest one yet 100 percent like i can tell immediately and you really don't need any water it, it's true i promise you i've never tried anything like it um, all you have to do is get your spoolie, whack it round just a little bit for about 5 to 10 seconds and then start brushing and it basically does it for you. It's unreal. Um, honestly, this is going to be a time saver. So for anyone like they say, I say they have all the texture gels but if you really love laminated brows and you want nice big full brows this is definitely definitely the best product they've brought out so far i'm highly impressed i was a bit um wary of it to be honest because i was thinking mm, is it going to beat color cubes and honestly i really think it has i think this is definitely going to be my new go-to i'll still use um color cubes maybe like on the everyday basis i don't know but this is honestly my new favourite. And it is the scent. The scent, honestly, guys. I don't know what the others smell like, obviously. But this chocolate one, oh, it's unreal. Absolutely amazing. So, as I say, I've had this on for about half an hour now. And it's so sturdy. They've not moved. Um, like I say, it can look a bit intense to start with. But once you put your face and everything on, it really doesn't. Um, I'd be interested to see what the other shades are like, the fudge one, or if she brings out more, that would be interesting. But, um, like I say, go and check out her website and her Instagram, because she has loads of information on there. But I just thought I'd show you all how I used it and my opinion on it, because I do get a lot of, like, compliments on my eyebrows and everything, so... Just so you all know, in the future now, if you ever want to know what's on my brows this is it if you'd like an in-depth tutorial on how to do your brows with this or i might do a get ready with me soon actually featuring it then let me know down in the comments but hopefully this video has been helpful if you have any questions about the product leave it down below i just want to also mention that it is messy it's one of the messy products where you have to clean it up with a wipe but when you get results like this it's it's really not a big deal, um, but I just thought I'd throw that in there as well because some I do get questions of that sometimes. Like, oh, you have to do this before foundation. You have to. There's, there's no other choice. So, yeah, if you do want to use this product, definitely use it before foundation. Otherwise, it is going to get super messy. And you will have to wipe around, but then it's absolutely fine. And you, like I say, you get results like this. You can't complain. But as I was saying, if you do have any questions about the product, then leave them down in the comments and I will answer them straight away. And if you have any video ideas, again, please let me know and I will get straight back to you and do them. Um, but yeah, hopefully you found this helpful and you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please remember to like, subscribe and hit the bell to make sure you none of my future videos. I just want to say one big, big, big last thank you for watching and I shall see you all in my next video. Bye guys.